I'm going to test whether azolla can be grown as a land plant. If it can be, I suppose it would probably want very wet conditions. I'm just going to fill this pot with soil. And then I'm going to set it in a tray of water and put the azolla on top. I have this tray of water. I'm just going to put it in. And now it's time to add the azolla. So I have this azolla. And I'm going to measure whether it can grow in land by two things. One, is it even surviving? Like, if it just dies, well then it obviously isn't going to grow in land. And two, if it is surviving, is more, is it like propagating or is more of it appearing? Can it even do that without the water it being able to float the plants around? I don't know. Here is my Zola a little bit more than a week after I started growing it as a land plant. I mean, and yes, this does have to have, have, to have a lot of water, but it is certainly growing in land. It's not like floating in water or anything. And it seems to have grown. I don't think it's grown the fastest, but the, le the individual leaves have certainly gotten bigger. You could probably use this as some sort of ground cover in very wet environments like a terrarium. This is pretty cool though. I think it's grown, yeah. Anyway, so yes, one, Azola does survive if you put it on land, and two, yes, it does propagate and grow. So Azola can most certainly be grown as a land plant, it just has to be really wet. If you like this video on how to grow, grow Azola, you might like my one on how to grow it in water. Check that out in the top right hand corner where I'll be putting it up. Thanks for watching and remember to like and subscribe.